All right, folks, this is a quick one for this evening because I had a gentleman, he's been messaging me today and said he got one of Lee Lodols on my advice and said he won't crimp new shells. I really don't know what to tell him. Um, this is a brand new Chidite, 28 and a half grains of long shot pattern. A white lightning, I got to cut it real quick. I've never had a problem at all out of that lead load all. White Lightning TPS wad, guys. Drop it down in there. Uh, 20 gauge, eighth inch nitro card. Drop it down in there. Now this is the part I'm wondering if he's doing wrong. When you get it down in there, you gotta tamp it down tight. Because if it sits up too high, it, it'll st your stack height will be higher. You got to tamp it down in there really good. 14 pellets, 32 cal, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14. 14 pellets of 32 cal. You're not getting 33 cal in a white lightning TPS. You can get it in an MG42. But it won't stack in this TPS White Lightning, guys. Just enough bubber to cover the top of it up. You can actually see the top two pellets a little bit. 12 gauge overshot card. Then I use, like I said, I use the wide guide. Push down on it a little bit. Set it down in there. pre crimp. Final crimp. I don't know what to tell you, partner. I can do them all day long. Then I can put them on my guy right here. And give it a slight taper and recess it in. I done did two of them already. No problems. 14 pellet double off. Three inch. We'll do one more. I just, I don't really know what to tell you because I can't, I'm not sitting there with you to tell you to see what you probably not got going right. Three inch Chidite again. TPS White Lightning. Three inch. Drop it down in there. Tamp it good down on the powder. 20 gauge, eighth inch nitro card. Drop down in there. Tamp it down good on top in there at the bottom. Get it good and flat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and fourteen. Fourteen pellets. Once again, thirty-two cal. Put some buffer powder on it. Tamp it down. Get it down around all your pellets good. Twelve gauge overshot card. Put in the back station six point crimp. Pre crimp. Final crimp. I mean, they're coming out looking like brand new shells. If you want to do a video, I ain't going to call out no name, but if you want to do a video and send it to me cause, so I can see your whole process of what you're doing, because somewhere along the line, I almost think you're getting your stack height too, too high. I don't think you're pushing that 20 gauge nitro card in the bottom. Once you put that finish taper on there, that thing is golden. The lead load all is a great little cheap machine and it'll load these shells for you guys all day long. I uh, just, I don't know what else to show him. But feel free to send me a video so I can see exactly what you got going on and maybe we can uh, figure out what's going on for you. All right, guys, that was, that was just using the lead load all, I guess what we'll call it. I got to get to loading now.
bow hunting is killing me, so I need a couple of days off later.